whether or not you win this thing, you've got to decide how you're going to walk out of here when it's all said and done. Because the game is going to go on. And there's only one rule you're going to need to know about. There are no second chances. There's only this moment and the next moment. Every one of those moments is a test that you get to take one time and only one time. So if you see an opening, tear into it. If you get a shot at victory, make damn sure you take it. Seize that moment. That moment is a crossroads where everything you want will collide with everything standing in your way. You've got momentum at your back. Fear and doubt are thundering like a freight train straight at you. And all you got, the only difference between making history and being history, the only thing, the only thing you can count on at any given moment is you. It's you versus them. You versus no. You versus can't. You versus next year, last year, statistics, excuses. You versus history. You versus the odds. It's you versus second place. Clock is ticking. Let's see what you've got. Like I want to make money, he got me out here swimming. I didn't ask to be a lifeguard. I want to make money. He got me in. So he said, come out a little further. Walked out a little further. Then he had it right around this area. The shoulder area. So this old man crazy. He making money, but he crazy. He said, come on out a little further. He came out a little further. It was right at his mouth. My man like, I'm about to go back in here. This guy is mine. So the old man said, I thought you said you wanted to be successful. He said, I do. He said, walk a little further. He came, dropped his head in, held him down, hold him down. My man didn't scratch it, hold him down. He had him held down just before my man was about to pass out. He raised him up. He said, I got a question for you. He told the guy, he said, when you want to succeed as bad as you want to breathe, then you'll be successful. Here's the thing that makes life so interesting. The theory of evolution claims only the strong shall survive. Maybe so. Maybe so. But the theory of competition says just because they're the strong doesn't mean they can't get their asses kicked. That's right. See, what every long shot come from behind underdog will tell you is this. The other guy may in fact be the favorite. The odds may be stacked against you, fair enough. But what the odds don't know is this isn't a math test. This is a completely different kind of test. One where passion has a funny way of trumping logic. So before you step up to the starting line, before the whistle blows and the clock starts ticking, just remember out here, the results don't always add up. No matter what the stats may say, and the experts may think, and the commentators may have predicted, when the race is on, all bets are off. any doubt in your mind about what you're supposed to do tonight and about how you're supposed to do it. This is your time. No, I don't want them to gain another yard. We gotta go out there and we gotta take it. You take their game and you shove it right back in their face. That's how winning is done. 
team is something you belong to, something you feel, something you have to earn. If we don't come together, it's over. And I guarantee you, we won't go by in your life. You won't regret walking out, letting them get the best of it. I'll ask you one last time. To be the best that you can be. Play like champions. Win. It's about heart. It's about who can go out there and play the hardest. It's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward. I don't care what the scoreboard says. At the end of the game, in my book, we're going to be winners. In any fight, it's the guy who's willing to die, willing to take the hits, who's going to win that inch. Let me tell you something you don't let me do. Nothing. We shut them down because we can't.